Hello everybody and welcome to Writer's Block. Now, this is a 2D horror narrative, I believe, point and click horror game that uh, I found over on Itch.io. It is made by Pixel My Heart and this is just the demo. I did not I don't think they've released the full game. I think this this is all they released is just the demo. At least that's all I could find. But as like a ooh. Okay, now the music's going backwards. All right. Uh, it's got really great reviews, and it's got uh, some different Sammy Awards, which is actually pretty good, so it's pretty promising. Hopefully this game will actually be pretty good. I have no idea how long this video is going to be, but I'm going to record until I complete it, no matter how long it takes, make this video as long as I need to. So just to give a little bit of a pres preface for it. You play as an unsuccessful horror writer, returning to his hometown after 10 years to finish his latest work for an upcoming book festival. In the process, he must confront the painful memories, anxieties, and re unresolved conflicts with the people he left behind since 10 years ago. So, let's see. Says his mental state fucks with him just a little bit, so we should see how things go. Oh, it's very beautiful. As I enter the lobby of the standard occasion, the smell of hickory and ginger waft over me. It is a small room, likely a living room before. Before it... Hmm. Before it got changed, but it still retains its fisherman roots. No, no, that's not it. That book is distracting me. That book is distracting you? Why? Twinkle by Ray Gibson. Twinkle. What a terrible title, Ray. At least he signed it to me. I suppose I owe him a chapter. Well, you owe him a chapter? Oh, a read? Okay, I see. To my bestest friend, thanks for coming. Thanks for coming? The screeching squeal of metal on metal screams in my ears. As I... F <laughs> okay, a little bit of a typo. This is a demo. It's not the full game, so expect some kinks. As I forcefully pry the open, open the cold gray spaceship wall... That was every agonizing cliche crammed in two pages. <laughs> that's the, yeah, it's pretty all right. I mean, yeah, the sci-fi garbage is a bestseller. Hey, man, that's that's what is gonna sell a lot. The shit that's cliche, like people pick up on those things. Like everybody says, oh, those things are bad, cliche, and all of that. Yes, it's very bad, but people pick up on that shit. It's called the bandwagon. That's why it's very very shitty. Seems weird this person has horns or something going on there. Hmm. What? We're already started into the horror, okay. His audience must be the most asinine common masses of... Of... No. I need to put this away and focus on my writing. Wow, okay. Things <laughs> definitely are not correct for my character. Nothing else. Actually, that gives me an idea. Once inside, I can hear the call of the ocean. Hmm, nice. Ooh, nice, ooh, where are we? The innkeeper, Mrs. Gladys, is not present. I need to find a way to get her attention. This is an inn? It looks just like a regular old house. A or D to move. Oh, okay, I thought it was a point and click, but I guess not. Oh, it is still. 11.13 a.m. Are they specific? Only the ashes remain. Stack of maple firewood... Ah, I can interact and turn the light on. Cool, cool. There's a lot of things here. Well-crafted helm made from redwood. Cozy little seat by the window. I always loved little, um... I don't know what you call it. It's not a veranda, but like a little window seat. A bay window, that's what it's called. I always used to like those where you could like sit up in it and like read a book or just, you know, just chill. It's nice. What is this? Winner of the 1995 fishing contest for largest bass. Okay. She did that? The in the the lady innkeeper did that? Hell yeah, that's what's up. I wonder where they found that. Uh, probably at an antique shop. Mostly classical literature. Some Hemingway, Oscar Wilde, and Mark Twain books. All of that's the same. Okay. A faux cherry blossom branch and sea glass vases. That must be Mr. Gladys. Oh. Oh, okay. Mrs. Gladys is, is the lady and then Mr. Gladys would be the... Okay, gotcha. Oh, I see. This is the... Whatchamacallit, the little counter here, I see. I didn't notice that. A porcelain clamshell. It appears three rooms are already occupied. 
A service bell. Perfect. I can ring for Miss Gladys. Okay, well, hang on. I'm gonna keep looking around. Empty. Dictionaries and other manuals. Beautiful replica of the May Mayflower. Ugh. If only I knew how to fish. Pictures of the local sceneries. Postcards from all around the states. Surprisingly not plastic. Oh! Hey! What's up, Gladys? I shouldn't really go further unannounced. Okay, yeah, my bad. My bad. I'll go ding the bell. I'm coming, dear. <laughs> Just keep clicking it. <laughs> Are you? Are you coming, though? Oh. Hey, I'll just, I'll just, you didn't need to ring it that much, dear, so, <laughs> I like that this game actually picked up on that, that's awesome. I heard you the first time. <laughs> She's just like sassy as shit right now because I was pressing the bell too much. <sighs> sorry, bam, sorry, yeah, sorry. It's alright as long as you don't do it again. <laughs> Actions speak louder than words, you know. Uh, my phone's vibrating? Escape? Okay. Oh. Call. Ray? Wait. Oh, that was inside the story. Whoa, okay, that was trippy. I thought that was like some weird sort of flashback or something that was... Okay, that was awesome. That was awesome. Hey, man, you're missing out on the after party. One of the fans brought me to a restaurant. And let me tell you, the food is out of this world. Who would have guessed that a Michelin star chef is a Twinkle fan? A, a Michelin? Hey, man, are you still there? Hello? I'm kind of losing my mind over here. Sorry about that. How... How can anyone be his fan? How can anyone enjoy this crap? What the fuck was on that? <laughs> Whoa, there was a hand coming out of the, of the fucking book. Okay, guys. We are in for a wild ride here. I don't know how long this demo is. But we're gonna... We're, strap in, guys, because I'm, I'm playing through the whole thing. I should flush it down the toilet where it belongs. Oh, okay. Oh, that's myself. I deserve that fame. I worked hard for it. He just gets it handed to him. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking asshole. I'm kidding. I'm too upset to sleep right now. There's not a lef enough left to get drunk. Oh, it's a mini fridge. I was confused. Just another pair of jeans and a jacket. Oh. I like... I like that one. That's a nice little... He said, I prefer my green jacket for now. Alright, well, fuck you then. That air vent needs a good scrubbing. I feel like some, I'm gonna look different in that one of these times. That's as bright as it gets. Oh, that's fine, though. I mean, it's late outside. Yep. Uh, oh. <laughs> the bathroom's over here. I thought this was the front door. To the right, but I guess not. Whitening mint toothpaste. I need a new toothbrush. It's on. Can I flick it off? Ooh, I don't like that. Okay. I, I, I really don't know what to expect out of this game. I don't know how much of a horror it is or if it's just all like a psychological thing. A bottle of hydrogen peroxide. Why is it on the ground? Bleach is not safe for consumption. Yeah, you're right. I should take out the trash eventually. Take a shower, shampoo. I want to tear this book apart and stuff it down the drain. I shouldn't be doing this. I shouldn't be blaming him. This has been our dream since we were kids. He's my best friend, and I should be supporting him. I should be, but... I can't. His plot is derivative. His characters are flat. He's a joke among critics. He doesn't deserve any of it. Whoa, okay. Maybe I should have written science fiction. Um, okay. Oh, this isn't my apartment? Okay. The power button is stuck. I can't activate it. Uh, well, it seems like all the power is on anyway, so... Shipping containers holding the passenger's baggage. Oh! Extraterrestri extraterrestrial? I'm not extraterrestrial. Extraterrestrial life form detected. Executing protocol seven. Oh, there we go. I thought this was a human vessel. That's what I was about to say. I'm not extraterrestrial, unless you know it's aliens. Those aliens and humans share many similarities. 
from appearances to cultures and daily functions. Okay, I'm not gonna, <laughs> I'm not gonna keep talking in that robot voice. However, there are two key distinctions. The Xylians are more technologically advanced, and they have a much slower respiratory rate. Is that it? Yes. <laughs> That's rather unimaginative, Ray. Unimaginative, Ray. Trust me, simplicity sells. Right, I'll play along. That's the spirit. Now, to be a Xylian, you must hold your breath. Oh, and move slowly. What? Right mouse to hold your breath? Are you kidding me? So I can't hold it for that long. Okay. Hold my breath. Go. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. I made it through. More baggage, I assume. I mean, what else would it be? Protocol 7 lockdown. Administrative passcode required. Okay, well... That's weird. I can move this around, but only slowly, and if I go outside of it, then I stop holding my breath. If I hold it down for too long, I'm assuming I'll die. Dang it. Here we go. Red above, my Icarus. Red below, my Perithos? Perithos. It's a cassette. Yeah? Red above, my Icarus. Red below, red, <laughs> red below my Perithos. Whatever the hell the Perithos is. There's a number on the back. 1992. Hmm. I'll keep it with me for now. I could have guessed 1992. Are you kidding me? Okay. Whatever. Let's input these... This code, 1992. Oh, well, there were five things. I just noticed there were five boxes for me to input numbers into, but I only needed 1992. Okay. Uh, inaccessible. So this is an elevator. Okay. Let's go to... Well, let's go to the laboratory. I mean, it's the next floor. Oh. Biolab. Exit. Biolab's ahead and the exit's above. Great. It's impossible to open by force. I can, I can use that to unlock the door. Okay. Iris unrecognized. Okay, well. Alright, let's keep going up. I'm getting close to the source. Source of what? Okay, let's go down to the lobby. Oh, okay. Crew quarters, the top floor. I think I was in the cargo bay. Oh, okay. I'm an idiot. I feel like an idiot then. I thought I was in the crew quarter because it was red. Trash. What a half assed attempt at what? What is- I, I don't know what that's a half-assed attempt at, okay. Attempt, rather. Either the ship's been in disarray for months or those vines have been growing fast. Probably f going pretty fast. It looks irritatingly familiar. Uh, it doesn't to me. The only thing it slightly looks like is Kirby, but... I'm using it still works. I could use a drink, okay. Well... Oh, that saves you my game! Okay, cool. Cool, cool. Oh, that is beautiful, dude. This looks like, um... Not the longest journey, but I don't remember what that's called. Ah, if I remember it, I'll, I'll put it here. Bing! There, it's on the screen, whatever the game is. I don't remember the name of it, but now y'all know what it is. It's actually pretty awesome. It must be nice to sit here and see the stars every day. It's just, it would just be beautiful not to just see the stars, but see the fucking planets. Like, oh my god, that'd be beautiful. Okay, I turned those on. The ocean planet is named after the Greek goddess of marriage. Hera. Hmm. Per Perithus is Hera's largest moon. Perithus. Perithous. I really don't know how to pronounce that. With an icy surface and hydrosilicate core. Alright. I thought I saw something. Maybe if I remove some of this dirt. Okay, I thought those were hair follicles, and I thought he was looking really closely at something furry. And I was like, why are you... why? Um... Oh, there we go. Why is this so red? Oh god. Yeah, that plant looks weird. It looks like fucking hair. I'd rather not find out what else is buried. Okay. Whatever, man. It must be nice to sit here and see the stars every day. But now you're looking at the planet, bitch! No, I'm kidding. Okay. But sometimes you get stuck on the big picture. And you forget about the smaller things. Yeah. 
Oh. Okay. Okay, this is just how we're gonna be. Okay. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. What? 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 Is this is this is this his book? Twinkle. What the fuck, Ray? What the fuck? Are they being forced to do this? No, it is voluntary. They don't even realize I'm here. What the fuck is going on? Names and dates. It's a memorial, but why is it here? It's Twinkle. That's all he is. What? I wonder if the whole ship's infected. Okay, well... Okay, wait, actually, I didn't read the uh, this plate down here. To our 25 years of friendship. It's Twinkle. So, that's it? That's all there was to that. Great. Great, great, great. Would you look at the view? Incredible. It's not often you get to look at life from a distance. It's a whole new perspective. Okay, that's all you had to say about that. Uh, I'm going to save my game one more time. And then I guess go upstairs. I don't know. There was nothing here for me in the lobby, though. At least that I saw. Um, I cannot go up to the crew quarters. It's inaccessible. So the bio lab. And I can't open this. It says I can use that. Oh. Red above my Icarus. Red below my Perithus. Oh. Those lights are signifying something. So I need to... Those two are correct. The six and five are correct. But this needs to be something else. Oh. Okay. I, <laughs> I have no idea what the fuck I just did. But okay, I did it. I figured it out. <laughs> oh. The Lamia Project seeks to develop a bioagent for accelerated plant growth. Why? Why do you need accelerated plant growth? I mean, I guess if you're colonizing another planet, that would make sense. Uh, okay, that's all that says. There's a dead body up there. Yep, the vines. They're feeding off of her corpse. Ugh. A marble? Oh, why? Fuck you. Fuck you. It got so quiet. What is that? I don't know. Uh, the stench I'm going to vomit. I'm... I'm... Oh, I'm getting the heebie-jeebies right now, man. The screwdriver? No, this isn't right. Why am I thinking like this? What do you... What? What do you mean? I need to stop thinking like this. What are you talking about? This is your fault. No, no, no. Shut up. This is your fault. These thoughts won't go away. I can't stop feeding them. They're killing everything. Just go away. <laughs> Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? No, this is your fault, Ray. This is your fault. This is fault? Because he crossed out your... Oh my god. <laughs> oh, oh, that gave me a fucking heart attack. You don't deserve success. You didn't struggle. You didn't endure. You got lucky. You're a joke. Don't you get that? <laughs> what about your... Or what about you, my so-called friend? You think you're better than me, but in truth, you wish you were me. Go to hell. You want the world to revolve around you, but you're just a petty wannabe writer whose vanity surpasses his talent. Is this is this my brain fucking with me? Because it did say that there was I had some psychological issues in the um, game description. Admit it. <laughs> this is your fault. Whoa, dude! It looks like a it looks like one of the things from what's it called? What is that game called? Soma. I don't know why I couldn't remember that game. That game is phenomenal. If I can play that on this channel at some point, I will fucking do that. This is your fault. Your pride. Your arrogance. 
Oh, it crashed. Oh, wait. I don't think it did. I think this is just... Part of it? I don't know. I think it made my computer crash. I don't know. Hang on. Okay, no, that was just part of the game. I thought... I thought it... Okay. What happened? It's black. I think the game crashed. What do I do? Turn the computer on and off. Wait, I'm confused. If Ray wrote a book called Twinkle, why? Were, how were we just playing Twinkle the game, but as kids? That doesn't make any sense. Turn the computer on and off. Ah, oh, yes, this, the, the staple way to fix anything. No spice. It's not working. The button is stuck. Stop pushing it. Your game broke the computer. No, it didn't. Yes, it did. No, it didn't. Yes, it did. My mom's gonna be mad at you. She's gonna be mad at you, too. What do we do, then? Hmm. I know. My dad showed me how to open a stuck paint can before. That's why he found the screwdriver! Okay, okay, okay. So they're gonna try and pry the power button off and something's gonna happen. I can push the button out like a lid, but I need a screwdriver. My dad keeps his toolbox somewhere in the kitchen. So that's why he found the screwdriver in the game, which doesn't really make sense, but it kind of does. I don't fucking know. Let's go get it. Onward to the kitchen. Okay. Is it in here, maybe? It's locked. Mom's drawing supplies. She hasn't painted for a while. Teen magazine. Gossip girl. Hey, that's you. Grandpa looks so young back then. That's me and my family at the Green Bay. Or at Green Bay, I guess you should say. Nothing to do outside. Okay, it was through here. I'm not allowed to go inside Mom and Dad's room and they're not here. Well... Where's the kitchen? Is it this way? Okay, that was not very obvious, game. I don't need to use the bathroom right now. We can't eat yet until the computer is fixed. Why? Why? Is, is your mom's not here? She's not stopping you. Is that made of paper? Maybe? Fans in the bathroom. Mom's making casserole tonight. I like casserole. Casserole is kind of like a, a generic term. I mean, you may make a casserole, but what's in it? I mean, like, you know, I should wash the dishes eventually. How do babies say hello? They microwave. Wow. <laughs> okay. Uh, there's a screwdriver in the kitchen. Where? Where, though? I thought it was in the kitchen. Isn't that what they said? It's in the fridge. Um... Maybe I need to move one of these chairs and pick it up off the top of the fridge. Oh, it's in that toolbox. It's too high. Okay, okay. Let's find something with wheels. Okay, so this one. But we're going to get hurt. Maybe the bike? I don't know. No, we do use the chair, but then... Let's use that. Okay, I guess I had to click on it before I tried to interact with it. Okay. There we go. I don't know. That was weird. Okay. I like that walking animation. It's kind of goofy. I'm going to get hurt. I'll hold it so you can go up and down. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. That's a little bit safer. It's too high. I need something to climb up there. Well, fuck. Oh, there you go. Just climb on top of that. It's too high. Oh, what? Okay, I got it. <laughs> Why'd you have to get up there? It's like, just just reach literally right there and grab the box. Okay. Oh, shit, my bad. Okay, now I walk over here and get back down. Safe. Come on, let's head back to the computer. Oh, well. Um, I'll hold it so you can go up and down. But we're not going to take the chair? What? Okay. Okay. Whatever, I guess it doesn't matter. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> He's literally just fucking slamming that shit into the computer. Are you kidding me? That's not going to fix it. Is it working now? How about now? Almost there. <laughs> yes! <laughs> what? That's not how that would have worked. That's not how that would have worked. Hooray! Thanks, Ray. <laughs> no problem. That's what friends are for. I got your back and you got mine. Well, isn't that nice? Oh, we're back here. Nice. Why am I just standing here looking at my screwdriver? 
or whatever's in my hands. I remember that day. Mom didn't realize a thing and we got away with it. This music is still too cheery for this fucking situation I'm in here. Ray and I made a pretty good team. Dot dot dot. I almost forgot about that thing. Yeah, I was about to say, hello. It's been staring at me, but it hasn't moved. Is it frozen? No, it's dormant. Now is my chance to escape. I can finally get out of this nightmare, but I need to remain calm. Breathe in, breathe out, slowly. Oh. Oh. God damn it, Ray. So I guess there was no way. Screw you. Screw your book and good riddance. Hope the rats get more satisfaction consuming your garbage. Whoa. So nice of you. Oh, he's in a, he's in a hotel. Or motel, whatever. Hm. Late. I need to sleep. You're not even gonna, like, save your document or anything. You're just, okay, gonna go straight to bed. What if the power goes out and your laptop dies? Hmm? End of Sunday. Oh, how long is this? Monday. Coming soon. Escape the monster for bonus contents. Oh! Oh, so that's the end of the game. Okay, so there's more if I go escape the monster. Okay, guys, I'm gonna go do that real quick. Oh, here we have all of the lovely developers and special things here on this screen. So you guys can see all those things, but I will be right back and I'm gonna see what, what happens if we get past the monster. Breathe out. Slowly. Okay, it literally plonked me back in immediately. Okay, just don't move the mouse. Okay. Oh, yeah, let's just leave this area. Okay. Sweetums. Okay, so I wonder what else is going to happen. Oh! Shh! Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> that scared the shit out of me. I was not expecting that. Oh my god. Screw you. Screw your book. I hope the rats get more satisfaction. <sighs> Let's see if that changes anything else. <clears throat> if it doesn't, I'm going to see if there's more to this game. Okay, I'm back here, so let's see. If there's anything more, I'm going to go down to the cargo bay. Hold shift and move, why? Oh, oh, oh! Um, 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 okay. There we go! Go through the door! Phew, okay, so I, I did it. I escaped the monster successfully this time. That last time was only a fluke. Holy moly, okay. Phew, just let it go. I, I fucking hate being chased, and I know I say that a lot, but it's true. I fucking hate it. It's like the worst feeling to me. Calm down. Okay. God damn it, Ray. I know it's not your fault, but I wanted to believe it is. I wanted to for so long. Because if it's not your fault, then it's my fault. And that's... That's a shitty thing to feel. Dot, dot, dot. I'm not going to flush your book. Instead, I'll show you and everyone else. My book's a bestseller, too. You'll see. Well, that's that's the better man of you. That's the better man of you. It's late. I need to sleep. All right. End of Sunday. Okay, okay. That didn't really give me much more content, but that's what's up. Oh. Something feels off about that chair. Uh, what exactly? <laughs> I didn't mean to actually go in here. Working progress comes soon. Coming soon, okay. Uh, I'm gonna keep exploring this area. This is pretty cool, but I'm gonna talk just a little bit more. Okay, this is this game is pretty awesome. I actually cannot wait to to see more of this game. And when it when it, ooh, what is that? 
when the uh, when the full game comes out, I'm definitely going to give this a play because, oh my god, this is awesome. I'm going to finish this game, and it's going to be amazing. So it seems as though this place is going to keep going, and these are all going to be levels, maybe. I need to get closer. Working progress. Work in progress, I think. I'm not sure if the... Uh... Huh. Well, okay. I'm not going to spoil any more about the extra stuff. Ooh. It looks there, as you can see. Like I said before... Oh, no, that's just the rope on the curtain. Okay, I can see it over here. Because it looked like in the beginning there was somebody, uh, a girl that had horns on that twinkle cover, and I was thinking something was up with that, but I guess not. All right, well, like I said, I'm going to end this episode here. This game was actually pretty awesome, uh, and I'm hoping that they're going to keep up the awesomeness with the rest of this game, and I'm going to keep updated with it, not necessarily on this channel, but for myself, so that when this game does come out, I'll be ready. I will be, like, like a prowling cheetah about to get its prey, and I'm just going to release that shit. I'm going to get that shit done and get it out to you guys, because holy balls, this game is awesome. <sighs> Thank you guys so much for watching, and if you liked it, please hit that like button down below. It really helps me out in the long run, helps me know if my content is good, if people are liking it, and whether or not I should keep bringing it to you. Again, thank you for watching, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. Whoa. Okay, guys, I actually stopped my recording and I had to restart my recording because I went to explore a little bit further just to see if there was anything else to this game. And I just came into this room and it doesn't say work in progress. So let's see. It's a key. That door. Oh. Was this game not over yet? It's locked. The end. Thanks for Okay, this is the this is the official end. Wow, okay. It's just me and this girl up here. Interesting. I dig it. This looks a lot like the wallpaper that I have. Not really a lot like it, but it looks pretty cool. Alright, well like I said, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will catch you in the next video. Bye bye.